Hello everyone, I'm Rhino Clavin with your Diz Daily Fix for Thursday, September 21st, 2017. Here's what's happening today. First up, the Walt Disney Company has announced a $1.5 million commitment to the Hispanic Scholarship Fund. Uh, the fund was established in 2014 with a $1 million grant from Disney and continues to play an important part in the company, company's efforts to assist students from various backgrounds in their pursuit of educational goals. Uh, scholarships have been awarded to 200 plus college students since the Walt Disney Company HSF Scholarship Scholarship Fund was established. Uh, Disney's 2017 donation will extend the program and support HSF's mission, which is to give its students the tools they need to succeed in their coursework, graduate, enter a profession, excel, help lead our nation going forward, and mentor generations to come. So, um, Next up, uh, the Disney Parks blog has announced details for the new interactive show with Doctor Strange that's coming to Disney Cruise Line's Marvel Day at Sea. So uh, guests of all ages will be amazed by the special effects and projections that will transport them from the Walt Disney Theater to the New York Sanctum Santorum, the residence of Doctor Strange if you're not familiar. Uh, here you'll learn from Doctor Strange the ways of the mystic art, and after the training, a battle breaks out, and Doctor Strange will need the help of his new apprentices to defeat the Dark Dimension. So pretty cool. Sounds like a lot of fun. Um, and uh, just so, uh, so this, for our third story, I found this really interesting. I just want to direct everybody to an article that is on www.info.com um, that is, uh, might be pretty helpful this time of year that lists um, all the places where you can get the food and drink um, and novelty collectibles uh, that can be found at Walt Disney World and Disneyland Resort. So you can uh, find stuff like Halloween popcorn buckets, poison apple steins, poison apple glow cubes, there's uh, the Headless Horseman glow straw clip, and of course the highly coveted hitchhiking ghost tiki mugs second edition they're all listed about where you can find them in this article so um, while you're over there too you're going to want to check out our featured article of the day which comes from brandon morocco who writes about disneyland versus the magic kingdom and in this version the tomorrowland edition so check that out many other great articles on wdwinfo.com so uh, our featured thread today uh trending on the dis boards is um a thread started by poster sl6827 who describes her local zoo um has brought her to the realization that disney has spoiled her family with their amazing parks um which is true uh other posters are weighing in with specific reasons that they feel the same way and also pointing out how they uh, that can work in reverse sometimes such as when you stroll through the world showcase at Epcot and it bring, brings back memories of those countries that you visited uh, sounds like an interesting thread it's titled all I can say is that Disney has spoiled me on the theme parks community board at disboards.com you can go over there join in on that discussion it is Thursday which means there is a new episode of the universal, universal edition of the Diz Unplugged and in today's episode Craig and myself will be discussing our Halloween Horror Nights adventure uh, it was a lot of fun. Be sure to check out that episode in all the usual places, disunplugged.com, iTunes, and of course, uh, youtube.com slash disunplugged. Now, finally, everyone's favorite part of the show, the weather. As you can see here, uh, it is sunny today in Orlando with a high around 90. Tomorrow is going to be a little lower temperature. Highs in the 85, but there are some scattered thunderstorms in the forecast. Lows both days have, uh, have us in the mid-70s, which sounds wonderful. Out in Anaheim, though, they've got it pretty nice. Today and tomorrow, it's highs in the mid-70s. 70s lows right around 60 just beautiful theme park weather especially for the holiday season uh, for links to everything that was discussed in today's Diz Daily Fix you can visit the Daily Fix main page at wdwinfo.com slash daily fix that's going to do it for me today I hope you all have a great day bye everybody